What is up guys, welcome to today's play review. Today we have a silver inform, which we haven't done this week I think, and I love to review informs are bronze and silver because sometimes they can exceed your expectations and be better than gold plays surprisingly, and sometimes they can be very very shit. Now, is this guy shit or is this guy good? That's what we're gonna find out today. If you guys are looking for a cheap, reliable place to get your coin, check out patelay.com. Their link will be in the description. Use the code Italy to get 5% off. Or if you're looking for PSN cards, Microsoft points, or just cheap games overall, check out G2A. Their link will also be in the description. Now, what I'm going to be actually talking about here is a lot of the negatives this guy has, and he goes for around 110k on the PlayStation 4. I'm not too sure how much he goes on Xbox. I think he's getting price fixed on there, so he might go for a bit more. Now, to begin with, actually, let me start with his benefits because there isn't that many. <laughs> You're going to be surprised here. He has good pace to begin with. Uh, for a center attack in mid, if you have anything over 70 pace, for me, is a plus. That is good. Very good dribbler. Even though he has 80, 81 dribbling on his card, he felt way better than that. I felt that I could easily dribble past defenders with him. Very easy and very good at that. Now, finesse shots are amazing. This guy's finesse shots, I think I was so unlucky. I wasn't able to score, I think, none, I think. But when you look at it, when I'm shooting, when I'm taking finesse shots from outside the penalty area, you will see it comes very close. It hits crossbar a couple of times. So you could definitely, well, you're definitely capable of scoring finesse shots with this guy. He has decent pass nothing too special for a silver card I think his passing is good but nothing too special nothing too amazing now let's begin with this guy's negatives to begin with the biggest negative for me is he wasn't effective in matches at all center attack in mid I don't know he didn't feel strong and I like my center attack in mids to be to be stronger than that and also he has no heading I like my center attack in mids to head the ball at least now one thing that really surprised me is he is very very shit at finishing this guy I can't tell you how bad he is numerous times they should be sitters in the penalty area this guy shoots it directly at the fucking goalkeeper even though i try to direct it at the bottom corner or at the bottom right corner or across the goal he just keeps shooting it at the goal at the goalkeeper there was no fucking running away from it he was very unreliable in the penalty area guys i can't tell you how much i just couldn't wait to finish off this guy. Um, he is weak, not effective in matches. Uh, like I said, this is my opinion. He was just not effective for me at all. Three star skills and three star weak foot. And shooting from long distance, if you like to shoot from long distance, forget about it with this guy. He's not capable of scoring long shots unless you're going to take finesse shots from long distance with him. Other than that, totally not worth his price. I regret purchasing him for like 115k. Sold him straight away. And um, he has just a lot of negative and I think there's just way better options in center attack and mid in that league so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did I'd really appreciate like like you guys know I always like to give my honest opinion and as you guys saw at the start of this video his stats I think he plays seven games three goals two assists that's kind of shitty for someone that's 100k anyway hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you guys have a very nice day